Hey, hey everybody, that's Ratso. That's Miss Mia. And and who's that? Oh my gosh, plus Crumb. Oh. Hey, Chicago go. Hey, hey, Mr. What are you doing here? Yeah, what's up, Mr. Crime Wave? Nice to see you again. Well, we are doing installment two of a secret history of Chicago music special episodes of Chicagogo. It's a strip I do for the Chicago Reader covering obscure and not as heralded bands as uh, they oh, should be, right? but awesome bands. Oh, and we have a few special guests here today from those awesome bands. Anybody We're really from Chicago. From Chicago. Yeah. Yeah. Speaking of Chicago. Chicago. Speaking of Chicago, this is the last taping we're going to do before the Olympic Committee decides that Chicago gets the Olympics. Oh yeah, that's so right. So I, I thought I better use these Olympic jokes just in case we don't get it. Olympic and then I won't be able to use them, so I got to burn these right now. All right, Harry, quickly, Olympic okay. jokes, quickly. Do you know why the Russians are such fast sprinters? I don't know. Why are the Russians such fast sprinters? They use real bullets in the starter guns. All right. So, Mr. Crime Wave, the, the, the hits keep coming and the bands keep coming. Um, I'll let you introduce our, our next fabulous star representing his band. So, here you go, Mr. Crime Wave. Yes, we have Mr. Tony so with Tony. us here today, <laughs> formerly of the uh, sort of progressive rock band, Gabriel Bondage. Did a couple Woo! great records and uh, it's agreed to join with them. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> We're going to hear an unreleased song called Lies. Um, you suppose you got a lot in the can, huh? Actually, yeah, Gabriel Bondage recorded about two more albums worth of material before the band's demise in 1980. And um, finally, it took us 17 years to get a hold of all the master recordings, and we're going to release, re-release them. And this is a brand new song you're going to hear that's 35 years old. <laughs> hey, 35 years old, but brand new. That's fantastic. So uh, you guys played in Chicago in the 70s? Uh, yes. All from uh, about 72 to 1981. That's great. So what's your favorite Chicago rock memory? Opening for Rush, the band Rush. <laughs> do, no, 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 no. That's awesome. That was a Rush. Uh, it, it actually was, and they weren't that well known yet. It was a small club in the uh, western suburbs, and uh, the, the, it was a standing room only, and everybody, they were going, rush, 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 and we were going, we're going as fast as we can. <laughs> we're at it. That's awesome. Thank you, Tony. Hey, let's, you. let's check out this 35-year-old brand new song. <laughs> It took a long time to get to you Such a long time to see through And there's a yearning deep in your eyes, such a burning deep inside your eyes. Lies, lies, lies. Sometimes I
an incredible song thanks for choosing that and can you tell us about this next song that we're going to dance out on the l line too <laughs> 